seven I'm back okay so I'm doing another video today y'all two in one day aren't y'all excited okay <clears throat> so this video topic is give your man permission to cheat if you think he's cheating okay why I know this sounds this gonna sound crazy to y'all at first but listen <sighs> if you think your man is cheating but he hasn't admitted it and you don't have any evidence, but you just think he's cheating. And you kind of know it because, you know, the, it's it's too obvious. Um, and if you do have proof, even better. Okay, so if you want to keep your man and you want him to stop cheating on you and you already decided you're going to take him back because blah, 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 other reasons. Okay, whatever. I mean, a lot of people are married and tied financially. Uh, sometimes they're the child's father and they don't want to break up the family. Whatever your reason is for wanting to stay with this man, even though he's cheating on you, I'm going to tell you how to do it. Give him permission to cheat. And if you've been on his back about, oh, I know you're cheating on me and blah, 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 blah. And all of a sudden you say, hey, you know what? Go ahead and cheat. You can have a girlfriend. Don't worry about me. Um. So you're going to be getting all your sex from your girlfriend. You're going to be, um, you know, make sure you go to her house after work for dinner. Um, blah, 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 blah. Because um, your sexual privileges are cut off with me. So I do give you permission to cheat now. You do that. He's going to stop real quick. And he's, he's going to be like, Urk! cut her off quick. One, because when a woman is crazy enough to allow her man to cheat, after being crazy about him cheating, this is a red flag for him. He's like, oh my God, she's serious. She, she's getting ready to, to uh, go cheat as well and replace me probably with a better man. And she's just allowing me to cheat so I don't have to come to her for sex because now she's going to start looking for some other man. She's probably going to start sleeping with some other man. And she don't want to sleep with me and him at the same time. And oh my gosh, what have I done? So then he's going to straighten up. He's going to be like, okay, well, I don't want, I don't, I'm not cheating. And, and da, 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 da. And you're going to say, well, I already know you're cheating. I feel like you're cheating. So you might as well go cheat. Um, I feel like you're playing me for a fool. So I'm just going to get, go ahead and give you the permission to go cheat. You know what? Do what you want. Do what you want. Because you know why? I want you to be happy. Okay. So when he hears this, he's like, oh shoot, she's going to break up with me. She's going to leave me. She probably already got my replacement. I and mean, what if he's better than me? What if he's a better uh, man than me? What if he has more money than me? What if his penis is bigger than mine? What if, what if, what he's going to start thinking about all of this. So he's not going to cheat no more. He's going to cut that off quick. So like, like I said, give him a permission to cheat. <laughs> um, and the only way this is going to backfire ladies is if you married him for his looks and he married you for your help stability and money and if you take care of him this don't work for y'all this works for either a 50 50 partnership where both people want to be together this does not want this not, this does not work for if your man is just using you while he sleeps with other women this don't work for those types and I'm, I'm saying that because it just doesn't. Because those women know that those men are cheating. But they're just so hard up and desperate for a man, they won't say nothing. Okay? And and if they do, the guy will be like, and? You know, I've seen it. <laughs> so, this only works for women who, 
whose a uh, man does not want them to know that they're cheating or it's an it's not in a situation where they can cheat and get away with it just because the woman is desperate this is for a 50 50 or you know one-sided woman one-sided woman relationship like when i say one-sided woman relationship i mean it's like if he's a if he's your provider and he's sleeping with somebody else and you don't work and, and he's paying all the bills and he's sleeping with another woman and <clears throat> if you give him permission still to cheat but you you be very sarcastic about it he's gonna think you have found somebody with more money he's gonna think you found a replacement as well and men with more money have bigger egos so even though you know he's rich and takes care of you or he has money and takes care of you. He don't even have to be rich. He could just work a regular job and be your provider. Even if he's just that, he's gonna say, well, if she's giving me permission, that means she really didn't love me in the first place, or does she? Now now he's gonna have to figure out if you love him for him or his money. And, and you're still gonna be reaping the benefits because if y'all are married or together, you're still gonna be reaping the benefits of being the girlfriend and wife, but you're not gonna have to be putting out and giving and giving him sex because you know he has a girlfriend and he can get it from there. So now he's cut off from you. So now he's gonna be like, oh man, she now she's just using me. Now I have to spend money on two women. So then he's gonna be like, oh shoot. So he <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna have to let one go, and it's probably gonna be the one that costs him less to let go, basically. Um, and it's, it's, you know, especially if he has a lot invested with you, if y'all are married, if um, you know stuff about him. So, you know, it, 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 it all depends on the situation. But yeah, giving a man permission to cheat, first of all, it takes the thrill out of it. Because like if he doesn't come home late and if he comes home late or stays after work late, you don't, he doesn't even have to call and make up a lie anymore. He's just, you know... He, you already know what he's doing. So when he comes home, there's already going to be a thick atmosphere. And it, it, you're going to make his home uncomfortable to come home to. Um, like if he's been out late, he can't lie and say, oh, I had to work late or oh, I had a business meeting or oh, I had to do this. Because it doesn't matter anymore. You gave him the permission. So now he has to walk in looking dumb. Like, oh, yeah, I just cheated. And and he'll try to make up a lie. But all you can say is like, you know what? I don't, it doesn't matter, you know? You do what you want to do. You know, I just sat here and shopped online and ordered pizza. I had a good time. I drank my wine. I had a great time. I hope you did too. Um, being like some sloppy pajamas. Like, you know, I don't have to turn you on anymore. No you got a girlfriend for that. Uh, <laughs> but the, the funny thing is, it works. And you don't have to do it very long. Maybe like le in less than a month, your, your, situa your situation will be resolved okay and a lot of women find out oh, my man has been cheating on me for all these years or or they just find out oh my man cheated on me and I don't know what to do I'm so lost should I leave should I stay I don't know what to do he betrayed me blah 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 and they're acting like the victim but you got to take the power back into your own hands you got to you got to let you got to give him that permission and see what he does with it you say okay you want to cheat? Okay, here, go ahead. You got to spend double money because I'm still going to live the same lifestyle. I'm going to be ordering online. I'm not going to be cooking because you should have already eaten at your girlfriend's house. You know, all of that. He's going to be like, oh, shoot. Uh, and then he's going to think, you know, once you get your thoughts together, now, since he has permission to cheat, you know, so do you. Now you have an open marriage. And once he hears those words, like, if you find out your man is cheating, suggest an open marriage. Say, you know what? Yeah, you cheated. I'm not even going to be mad at you. You know, I'm not even going to be mad at you, you know. Let's just have an open marriage. You know, you like to date outside the marriage. Let's just have an open marriage. Don't ever say, I'm going to go date me and I'm going to go do this. Don't. Keep it all on him. Let's say, let's just have an open marriage. It's like, I don't want no open marriage. You'll be like, I don't want no open marriage. And, and you'll be like, oh, are you sure? Because you're acting like you want an open marriage. I just thought you wanted an open marriage. You know, I can, I can, I can deal with an open marriage. Keep putting it on him. Don't ever say, oh, I'm going to go be with another man. 
as long as you don't say those words, you have them in the palm of your hand. So say, okay, well, you've opened the marriage up on your own. So it's open now. And just walk away. Oh my God, he's going to be like, oh, what did I do? So, giving your man permission to cheat, giving your husband permission to cheat, giving your loved one, spouse, lover permission to, che to cheat is basically using reverse psychology. And it usually works if the, the relationship is not too one-sided. It usually works. So y'all try that because I said like somebody I know, they actually did this. And um uh, because they weren't they weren't finna they weren't finna give up their man. Their their man was like a ex athlete and he had money, right? Sorry y'all. Their man was an ex athlete and he had a lot of money. So he was he she was not gonna give that up, okay? So what she did is just, she just gave him permission. She's like, you know what, honey, go ahead. I am going to, I'm going to be at the, I'm going to be at the mall. And the more he cheats, the more money she's going to spend of his. And, and if they're married, oops. So he, he learned quick. He was like, oh my gosh, she's going to spend all the money. She's going to be buying shopping uh, therapy. Uh, she already knows I have a girlfriend. It's not as fun anymore because I can't sneak around. And when I come home, she know where I've been. Uh, she probably out meeting another man, maybe another athlete who has more money than me. Oh, and all this starts going on in their brain. And then they're like, oh shoot, let me just cut this side piece off and focus on her because obviously she's making plans. And then he's going to try to make it all lovey-dovey again and blah, 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 blah. And... If, he, if he's smart, he'll never try to do that again. And he'll understand, you know, just like he can do, you can do, but with his money. Okay. And if you're not married and you don't have access to his money, it's still an ego trip because, like, he can't call and lie to you anymore because it doesn't matter because you gave him permission. You'd be like, oh, no, honey, you don't have to lie. It's okay. Just go have fun. Like, whenever they say, oh, I'm going to be late, I'm going to be late. It's like, oh, you don't have to call me anymore. Don't worry about it. Just come home whenever you're done. Then they're going to be like, oh man, I feel stupid now. You know, because they're not tricking you anymore. It's not a thrill. They're not seeking, uh, they're not having fun with it because you already know. And they know you know and they have to come home to you. And it's like, ugh. So, spoil it for them. Spoil it. Don't hang it over their head. If Once you realize they're stop cheating, like y'all don't even have to be married for this to work and once you realize they have stopped cheating then you don't punish them for it over and over and over and over again no, and don't ever close the marriage back up or close the relationship back up always leave it open because then you don't have to go through this again you know then you don't have to worry about you know stuff like that the less you pay attention to him the less you care what he's doing where he's at if he calls you da 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 the more he's going to be worried about you. Okay? So, keep that in mind. Um, and if y'all haven't seen my video, ladies, about always have that backup plan, that backup man. <laughs> hey, it just depends on who you are. You want a black backup plan or a backup man? doesn't matter. Always have one of those as well, just in case. Or have both. Shoot. I, you know what? Have the best of both worlds. Have a backup plan and a backup man. Um, this way, if something goes wrong and you, and you just not going to take it anymore because you give him another chance, you tried this trick and blah, 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 blah. Now you can say, you know what? I tried. I gave you a chance. You didn't do right. You know, I, I, I'm just, I don't think I deserve this. I got to go. Let me get up. Let me pack my stuff. I got money saved. I'm going to go. If you're married, my lawyers will be contacting you. If you're not married, peace. Um, and just go get your own place. You know, you got a friend on backup. You know, y'all get closer, help, help each other out and every now and then and move on, you know. That's what you gotta do. So I, the reason I made this video is because I have so many women with this problem and they don't know what to do. They, oh, I think my man is cheating. Oh, this, oh, that. 
if you think he's cheating, he probably is, and you need to and you need to um, do something about it quick. And this is a quick step that you can do without much preparation. It's just a few words to make him think, and to also uh, make him feel guilty, and also make him accountable for what he's doing. He'll stop calling you and trying to lie to you to get more time out wherever he is because you don't care because the marriage is open now or the relationship is open. So now he feels dumb and kind of stupid, okay? So um, for you ladies out there that are going through that, try it and tell me how it works, okay? Bye.